Hi guys, why suddenly the craze about MBA? Everyone want to do the MBA. BCom, BMS, engineers, everyone is moving towards MBA. So in this video, we'll talk about the average salary, what is being paid to the to the IM grads or MBA grads in general. So starting with the first of all, if you might have read in the paper that average MBA value is going down because obviously a lot of B schools, there are 5,000 B schools in the country. Out of this 5,000 B school, only top 100 have some value. Same is for the engineering college as well. There are a lot of engineering colleges. Every city have got around 40, 30, 20 engineering colleges. But only the top two, top three per city is getting a good placement. So obviously the value of MBA come with the placement. Yeah. So in this video, we'll talk about the average salary which they're getting. So 30,000 people in the CAT exam this year. Out of 2,50,000 people who appear for the exam, 30,000 will get an average salary of around 6 to 7 lakhs. Okay. So now 6 to 7 lakh is not a bad salary, it's CTC obviously, but 50,000 per month is obviously a very good salary to start with. This is the starting package. 6 to 7 lakh is an average salary of an engineer from a good engineering college, top engineering college. So if you are the top 30,000, you are not the top 10% of the batch, 10, top 10% 10 of the CAT students, you are getting an average salary of 6 to 7 lakhs. So 12 lakhs, 12,000 people out of the number of people apply. So total number of applicants will touch around 2.5 lakhs. Out of 2.5 lakhs, 12,000 people will get a salary of 10 lakhs plus. And 5,000 people are going to get a salary of approximately 20 lakhs, 18 to 20 lakhs. Now that should be your target. If you're trying to give an MBA, your target have to be the top 10 colleges because you're getting a package of 20 lakhs. Now, just imagine, can you give me any other career which can give you an average salary of 20 lakhs starting salary by preparing for one year? IAS, uh, bank government exams. IAS will take around three to five years preparation. CA will take the four to five years preparation starting from the graduation. So if you want to start today, within one year as an MBA, you can get a package of around 5,000. Around 5,000 people are going to get a package of 20 lakhs. That should be a target. Okay. So if no one is getting or if only 10 people are getting, so obviously I might think I can't get in the top 10 students of the country. But 5,000 people is your target. Yeah, 5,000 students are getting a package of around 20 lakhs. So you don't need to be rank 1, you don't need to be a topper, you have to be among the top 5,000 people. Possible? Obviously. So you have to work hard. So once if you can get it, and that is around 98 percentile in the CAD paper, 1999. 99% of the CAD paper is only 150 marks out of 300 which is around uh, 50 marks out of 100. So to do 50 question correct out of 100 in the CAD paper to get an average package of 20 lakhs. Okay, and that should be your target. If you can't get 99 percentile, so you have to know top 12,000 people. Top 12,000 people will get an average salary of 10 lakhs and 30,000 people will get a salary of 6 to 7 lakhs, 6 to 8 lakhs. Okay, so your target is to be in that many student. Okay, uske niche there are a lot of other B schools as well, which I don't recommend. So average number of students per B school is not touching 300. So average is 300 students. Kisi mein 400 hai, kisi mein 200 bhi hai. So average is around 300 students. So 300 into 100, 30,000 students. Top 100 B schools is something which is valued. So the ranking you can see anywhere on Google. There are a lot of ranking going on. So if you are selecting a B school, make sure that college is in the top 20 rank so that you can at least get a 6 lakh a package. So 6, 10, 20. That's the average salary. That's why everybody is moving towards MBA. That's why the B schools are also charging a very high fees because obviously they can feel the return coming out to the students. So I'm Ahmedabad have an average salary of touching out 25 lakhs. So they're charging a 23 lakh of fees. So B school is acting as a placement agency. So they'll charge you one year ka fees as advance. Like whatever you're going to earn after your MBA, give us approximately average one year ka fees as your fees, one year ka salary as your fees. And then you can start your, then you can earn. Which makes sense because in the long run, like if you're from the top B schools among these 5,000 people, these are all the IMs, SPJ and FMS, all the top 20 B school of the country. If you're passing out from these colleges, within five years, by the time you touch the age of 30, your package will cross 30 to 40 lakhs. And trust me, once you're earning a 40 lakh a package, it doesn't make a difference whether you spend 20 lakhs on MBA or you spend 10 lakhs on MBA. Yeah, so fees are with the other factors involved as well. But this video was more mainly talking about the average salaries. So your target, if you're preparing for the CAT exam to be in the top 5000 people so that you can get an average salary of 20 lakhs. And trust me, it's not about you. It's about the family. You're not doing it for yourself. 
you your family your parents will be more than happy than you if you can achieve that target all right so let's work hard for the cat exam all the best